The last eight minutes, bro. I ain't got nothing to say, man. I ain't got nothing to say about the last eight minutes, bro. Ottawa, Bum O'Clock, Rock the Lee Desh. It's like what I said, Director Tosama. Yo, we're here for some more heat with you guys, man. And uh, <laughs> honestly, I don't have too much to say as an intro. I, I actually just don't. Um, except that, you know, we got introduced to a new character. My take is her daddy is someone important in this anti-sex or world politics. Yep. And his, unfortunately, his, this is going to be every father's worst nightmare because his daughter, <laughs> she's going to be wanting to be for the streets, man. I thought you told us how going to be that. She see terrorism. She want to be part of that. Mm -hmm. Yep. My daddy don't like this, so guess what I'm going to love? Mm -mm -mm. That's a traumatic story, man. That's a traumatic story. It'd be like that, though. Yeah. But uh, the last episode was hilarious. It Fua, was. Fua definitely, uh, she was already high on the list, but I definitely got her... I think I'm gonna have a sneaking past Anna Sunpai as of right now. Bro, the scientist trope was always very appealing, bro. Mm, Cause I remember always. in Bunny Girl Senpai. Yeah! I, I don't really claim her like that because of other reasons, but but the personality, the vibe, that kind of stuff, I thought that's a really cool character. I love how Shad is like that in my life. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And really you're getting chill, something similar. Soothing, intelligent, just carrying logical conversations. And intelligent, mm -hmm. bro. Mm -hmm. Like real talk, like in real life. You get some scientist girl that's just talking about all these insects and stuff like that. I would, I would actually be intrigued. Like that's that's intriguing. Now you get over your your spider phone. No, I was just gonna say as long as she's not talking about spiders, we cool. So you'll, you'll Other insects and shit, bugs. I'm cool with that. Yeah, yeah. I, I, I get some grasshoppers. Oh, you know what? I take it back. I don't want them in the house. Never mind. They're gonna be in the house. She's gonna be so comfortable with it. You're just gonna have random ass no, bugs in lab. the house. No, that's why she got a lab or yeah. a garage or a shed. Until they take the lab home. Keep that shit. Up. No, I will build shoddy. If I fuck with shoddy like that, I will build her a lab I'm in the backyard. Take a little iron shed from Home Depot. You not bring that stuff in my house. And then when there's an outbreak, your your house is very close, and they come <laughs> near, bro. Tell you, promise you, I'm gonna have the raid out the back porch ready. I see that, man. Well, the raid, I'm I'm putting a line of traps, and I'm getting past my line. It's attractive, but the whole Shino clan, I want nothing to do with them. <laughs> I want nothing to do with them. <laughs> but all right, we're gonna we're gonna jump into the reaction. Y'all know the deal. Smash a thumbs up, drop a comment. We post the stuff early on Patreon. We guys, oh, sorry, 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 my pitch. We got serious. My fingers is faster than my. <laughs> we got series I've never seen a lot of damn YouTube. I want to see some bras and panties and uh, I guess some boxers because they always come in a threesome. Reaction now. Who's your reactor? Oh, damn. No, they posed them too? Oh, that's good. They made draws out of the draws. <laughs> and then blurred it out? <laughs> she doesn't even wear a mask. Oh. Oh, it's... No, we were wrong. They're, they're, they're also a, uh, they're also a group, a terrorist group. That's what they're, I thought they were talking about the incident, like they lost. Or does she have her own group under her daddy's nose? I'm gonna stop talking. Uh, I think it's stop. that one, I think it's that one. I it's think the she, last one you said. Yeah. She has her own organization under her daddy's nose. Yeah. And her daddy's a wuss. Yeah. I guess. Oh, there's the story. This is my My loins. You got a whole terrorist network out here. Super <laughs> Now they got into furries, they were just so yep. spreading smut, bro. <laughs> Yo, this kid, or this whatever. Man. That's a man, bro. <laughs> no, this dude is interesting, bro. I won't remember everything about his character. <laughs> 
Stop! This shoddy. She took the same thing I'm thinking, actually, basically. There's a penny thief! Oh, must be the dude at the beginning of the game, um, show them. Yeah. She's so serious. <laughs> I thought she really found something. She's so aggressive with it. Nah, she can really thrust. She can say anything we want about her, but them thrusts are serious. Thank you. How considerate. Oh my god, is she a demon? Oh my god! <laughs> Butt Buster Ultimate Muscle! So she ran over here as soon as possible. Oh, she got rid of him. Oh my lord. Is she tripping right now? Yeah, you can hear it. Oh, oh my, my god. god. Don't do that to me. Yo, this is insane. What kind of WWE shit is this? Oh my god! Stop! <gasps> Yo, this dude didn't do his job. Why is he back? Oh my god. Oh my god. And what else are you doing? Oh my god. Oh yeah, she loves Anna too. She's with all the shit. Oh my god, this is freak shit. Sticking your ear your tongue in someone's ears like that and the, she wanna taste all of him, bro. Yo, she'll eat his ass, bro. Like fam. Like a burn it? Oh! Why are you taking her from her? <laughs> she gave it to her, I feel like. He's about to beat her with this nudie bag, I swear. Oh, bacon lettuce community. Oh my God, they're inspiring an entire Yaoi movement. Because of tossing salad, am I missing something? They started drawing him and these two. From the mother lettuce community or something. Yep. Bacon, yeah. I feel like the name of their society is a play on what they're into as well. That's just what I think. <laughs> really? Is he wearing a skin of panties? Is that socks? More strong? <laughs> White climbers? Is he? <laughs> Yo, did he, is he stealing people's drawers to just put them in there? Wait a second. <laughs> oh my god, this is hilarious. Moist strong. Oh my god, do you see their logo? This Who? nigga made a pair of pa tiny panties for his wine glass. Oh, they don't like it. They made socks look bad. Yeah. Excuse me? Gallon? Jeez. Acts of petty theft. Oh, that's a crazy twist. Interesting. 
He knows who said the Russian one was large to poor Japanese. Oh my. <laughs> oh my. She can't use her hands. She can't use her hands. They actually explain why they can't be in line with them. That's wild. Wow. They're like, we are pure education and they are just for liberation. Our ideals are sound similar, but they don't line up. That's 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 how terrorism is actually deep with each other, so it makes sense, bro. It's religious terrorism. He fell for that shit? Yeah. Oh, he likes the innocent sweet thing. That's what he likes about Anna Senpai originally. Never mind, he actually proceeds it a little girl. Never mind. Oh, yeah. Yeah, leave her alone, bro. I'm actually mad that he's trying to restrict what she's into. Yo, and they make it's pretty McGrogy the bottom. <laughs> <laughs> She's hilarious. Got uncomfortable. <laughs> I need smaller. <laughs> That's so unnecessary. <laughs> what the fuck is going on? She's trying to act cute and he's trying to run away. But she acts like the wrong kind of cute, right? Yes. She's like a freaking Chucky. <laughs> she called him a lame MC, I'm dead. Oh shit. Now he's showing these images to a younger person. This is interesting. I didn't even register until you said it. This whole scene is weird. Oh my god. Wait, what? Oh, he backs. Oh, she doesn't understand. So her dad backs them financially? Backs terrorists, but was sucking up to PMCs, which makes sense. If you're gonna keep backing the terrorists, you gotta kiss up to the powers who be. Yes. Nah, man, this girl's trouble. Send her home. Funds. Oh, that's not real. <laughs> Yo, she's pulling a real Tui. Air guns, okay. Facts. She's violent. I don't trust this girl one bit, bro. She literally manipulates people. Yeah. Don't fall for this. Thank you. Oh my god. Wrong. I'm calling a spot on him. Oh no. Oh no. <laughs> oh, she's too much. Yo. I heard there's like a dick. Yeah, yeah. 
And it actually will get uh, like, uh, like erect, basically. There's times when it kept stiffening. As like she was, as if it was filled with blood. The last eight minutes, bro, I ain't got nothing to say, man. I ain't got nothing to say about the last eight minutes, bro. So hear me out, hear me out, hear me out. I was like, yo, he's into her because, uh, you know, the, the innocent vibe that she pulls off reminds me of the innocent vibe like Anna Senpai. Mm -hmm. And they were, they made a remark, oh, you with the little, and I was like, nah, he, he, he just wanted to help her because, you know, she was playing innocent and he just wanted to help her. But they keep insinuating with how they draw things and placing things that that's just some that's just something weird is going on. But he's actually not weird in my view. He's not weird, but the scenes that they are putting him in are weird. But he's not thinking about it like that, which is interesting because as a pervert, you would think of something like that and remove yourself from the situation. He's not, which is also showing how he's so not thinking about it that he's not even removing himself from the situation. And you just gotta accept that it happened because it's just, it's, just, it's just funny and then he's accepted it. I personally don't, don't, you know, I don't really vibe with that kind of humor, but um, that's where we're at. There she is. <laughs> and then I have to accept, oh shit, oh shit, oh shit, oh shit, oh shit, oh shit. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. <laughs> Father, speaking of if we would do that if we had the ability, blow your own trumpet. Oh, it's just repeated from the beginning. Yeah, all right. Yeah. And the last thing I gotta say, bro, is this is a show that implies that it, it will entertain. Oh, shit, this is the episode where they introduce the concept of different fetishes as like a whole thing when they was mixing up with these uh, uh, other groups, these other terrorist group. <laughs> so this is how things happen. And so you gotta expect every everything that people are into, bro. Yo, it was when you saw the furry drawing, you're like, oh, they going out. Oh, the furry drawing too, yeah, yes, no. yes. It's the last episode. Where Shadi goes, a woman with the third leg. I was like, oh, they're going everywhere. Yeah. I was like, nah, they're going everywhere. Yeah, so, I heard you, by the way, but keep going. Nah, I don't know what you're talking about. Okay. So full circle to find out they made this, uh, they made a, they made a hentai with him and Garoki. <laughs> where Garoki's the bottom. That's actually not surprising, oh, by the way. I heard you say they made Garoki the bottom. Ha, ha, ha. In fact, I, I feel like they've been implying that he would be the bottom. bottom. Yeah. Yo, so that's I, I, I said, remember everything about him, right? Um, obviously he kind of lit up when he was dressed a certain way, yeah. right? Um, now today's episode, they revealed that he's a cook, right? And he he's been making, he's been taking care of his little sister. He's been taking care of his little, and his voice kind of softened up. He kind of did one of these things. I was like, oh, he, he had a rough exterior, man, but like he, he's sweet. He's sweet on the inside. And I actually mean sweet as literally like, he's, he's kind, mm -hmm. not that sweet. I realize mm -hmm. there's a sweet that refers to something. Mm -hmm. I actually mean he's kind. So. Well, <laughs> does that mean you're bottom? I don't know. I don't know if you're going to serve him kind of a bottom. It's bottom I'm, energy. It's bottom it's, energy, bro. Yeah, this, this. He, he don't make you a bottom, but he got bottom energy. Yes, yes. He do. Thank you, bro. Is he do. Thank you. It's, the reason why it's funny, the reason why I thought it was funny is because they gave they gave uh, Okuma top energy. I'm like, he don't really got top energy. He's more like switcher. He could be a bottom too, bro. So that's why I was like, I was like, oh, that's why it's, I was like, it's interesting. Yes. That's why I was like, it's interesting they make Okuma on the top because out of both of them, either one of them could been the bottom, but it's interesting that the choice they went was like, got nah, Okuma's the top. Yes. That's all yes. it was. And, and it's one of those things, because you can't judge a book by its cover. So yeah, he look, oh, <laughs> But I think that's why they like it. Shadi's like, yeah, like the big, the big buff guy being all sweet and shit, like, nah. That's why it's perfect. They want a fake nigga, bro. That's what they want, nigga that don't exist. Well, they do want a nigga that don't exist. Mm -hmm. Yes, they do. And but don't we want girls that don't exist? No, I want a real girl, bro. Don't lie, bro. You know you want just the amount of Nino toxicity or the toxicity. Oh, but I also know I'm not gonna get it. But I also know I'm not gonna get it. So oh, that's the difference. I live in reality. That's the difference. I live in reality. We just joke about how nice it would be yeah, yeah, yeah. and then go for reality. Yeah. But they're literally going for fiction. Like, don't get it twisted. Nah, we're on the same page. I will build a figure and like this is my new Lego set. I love it. But I'm not gonna. I'm also gonna go find my shoddy. Yes. And they'll deny every good uh, man in front of them because they're looking for it. The Lego set, like you don't, this, you don't match a Lego set. Like you don't match a Lego set, so I can't. I'm like, you, you don't match wild? a Lego set, but it's okay. But you know it's wild? You know, at least when they finally find somebody or whatever, you know, they, they were going for their true desire, so to speak. Mm -hmm. So anyways, I can't get the right words, but hear me out. 
but you have what you want, but you're not going for it. So you slash men and slash whoever falls into this category. So you understand what your goal is or your desire is, that Lego set, but you don't actually go for it because you deem it as uh, impossible. So you just get somebody. So you are, it's almost like you're settling. I get the Lego like, set. Maybe you're not the Lego set. I already know you come with problems. Listen. This is, this, just that psychology is just interesting. I don't have an answer for it. I'm just noting it. That's fair, but also within that nuance, it's like if I want the bat, if I want the '96 Batman Lego set, and all they have is like the 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 Dark Knight Lego set, it's like that's close enough. I will get the Dark Knight Lego set because it's still Batman. I love that. Optimism. And the like, y'all's close. I was like, damn, I really wanted the old school '96 uh, one where he was fighting Mr. Freeze. I wanted that Lego set. I couldn't get that one, but I got. What year did you say? 96. Okay, so you get That's the one, you get, you get the other one, because that was great. No, don't worry. I, I made you meal paranoid. I just need to remember so I can talk. <laughs> I was like, is that enough years? No, no, That's no. 27. No, no. So you get the one that you, it's close enough. It's close, close enough. enough. Yeah. And then what do you do when 96 pops up? When 96 pops up? Nothing. Uh, if I still have my other Lego set, I just keep playing with it. You want to oh, get the 96? I'm, oh, I'm looking at the 96. Oh, okay. Okay. <laughs> I'm when the shopper <laughs> in the store ain't, got re ain't really that, got it. That's why it's still Boy, I'm a window shopper. <laughs> I love your optimism because that's that's that that makes sense. But I'm still I still think what I was questioning. Is Trust this, me, everybody yeah. not everybody, everybody got the Lego set that they wanted. Right, and you see the Lego set that you want. A lot more denial of that. I live. I listen. I as a black man in America, I had no choice but to live in reality at all times. At all times. That's why I, I can way. I can dream for something, but I know what reality will dictate. There's, there's nothing wrong with anything oh, you're saying. I, oh, right? I know that for a fact. I yeah. know that for a fact. I'm, just picking, people... I'm just picking it apart because this is this is interesting. This is interesting. I'm just picking it apart. See, people yeah. just people just settle in because they have to. <laughs> Yo, no, you I, laugh, I, I'm like... looking forward to hearing you guys' takes. I'm Yo, looking forward I, to hearing I promise takes. you, I promise you, you either hurt a lot of feelings. Or you made a lot of people like, yep, I know what I did, but guess what? I've been living a great life. I ain't, I'm gonna say something fucked up. Some of my friends 100% got settled with or settled, and they live very good, happy That's true. family lives. That's true. They but they don't know, but one or both don't know that the other settled. That's that's the thing. So how it can break someone's reality or whatever. Mm. That's why I kept asking the oh, question. Oh, how it can break someone's reality. Yeah, because like, like, okay, you, if you just okay. talk to somebody, you're like, yeah, of course I settled. Cause you know, she's not gonna be the Lego set. So, you know, she was close enough. She was close enough. And the girl is listening to that. It's like, so so I was close enough. Like I'm not, I'm not your ideal thing. And it's like, not, no, cause it doesn't exist, but you're great. She's not gonna receive it well. I know. I, I would, but I would wait. I would never. I know you can't say that. I know you can't. <laughs> we, of course, of course. I always be like, nah. I got lucky. You, I found you, and I got lucky. Oh my god. How did I fuck no, this of up? Course. Oh, I fumbled. Of course. That's why I, I'll never, I'll never say, I'll never. T it's like I always wait. Oh my god, I can't believe I fumbled this shot. You'll never hear me like, yeah, whatever. This is the reality that can never be said. Yeah, that's the reality that can never be said. Perfect. We're saying the quiet shit out loud. That's why and was, a lot of people don't like that. That's why I was picking at it, and we got oh, to the common yeah. consensus. Like, yeah, yeah, I know I can't say this shit to nobody. No, you can't. <laughs> like, You're not supposed to. But it, somebody settled in that relationship. Somebody settled, whether you want to admit it or not. And it is what it is. There's some that it's mutual settling, and that's beautiful too. I'm just saying, there is nothing wrong with it. I agree. As with long you. as both y'all happy and y'all just building and just living your lives, it's like, what's wrong with it? If you really found the perfect person, yo, good for fucking you. I just never ask that person. Never ask that person. If she's perfect to you, if he's perfect to you, do not ask if you're perfect to them. Don't get your fucking feelings hurt. <laughs> Don't get your hundred percent, bro. Because I promise you, in a relationship, somebody's like, no, that's exactly what I was looking for, and I'm so happy. But if you ask the other person, like, yeah, it's good enough. And it's like, and then you get their feelings hurt, like, don't do it to yourself. I know somebody's gonna settle for me, and that's okay, because I'm settling for you too. A hundred percent, hundred percent approved, bro. That I just, that, I'm glad I picked the conversation because we got to where I was with, but the, it came from your mouth. Yeah, it's one of those things where, uh, very much so. Fairy tales, not living in reality, but it is what it is. All right, Another show. Yo, all right guys, yo, thanks for uh, coming through. This show actually sparking legit real conversations, man. Um, we post our reactions.
sorry, the hiccups, early on Patreon, including the series that never see the light of day on YouTube. Check out the schedule for a list of that. The schedule's in the description of this video. Hit the bell for notifications. If you see us on your homepage, click on those videos. If you want to join us, go into the description. Hit that Discord link so you connect to us and the community. All right, guys. Until next time, Rock D. Lee. Direct Nasty. Out. What's going on, everybody? Thank you for subscribing to this channel. If you haven't followed me on Twitter, please go ahead and do so. The link is in the description of this video. And I actually tweet back. Much love, Rock D. Lee. <laughs>